What is up, ninjas? We are sitting in an abandoned Tesla, and now we are trapped in here. In the last video, we went walking for a long way, and we found this Tesla. The doors opened by themselves. It was really freaky. We went inside, the doors closed, and now the doors are locked. We're trying to get out of here. It won't budge. V, why don't you give yours a try? Nothing. On the screen on the Tesla, it said, now you are trapped and your YouTube is hacked. And we don't know exactly what that means, but please give us a thumbs up right now so our YouTube does not get hacked because we do not want that to happen. We think it might be one of our friends playing a trick on us. That's what we hope anyway, because mm -hmm. hope, hopefully they're not going to do anything mean. So leave a comment down below if you think you know who it is playing a trick on us. Maybe it's some, one of the YouTubers you saw in our past video. Hopefully we can get out of here soon, guys. We do not want this to turn into a 24-hour mm -hmm. challenge stuck in a Tesla. That's not going to be fun. It's starting to get a little bit dark out, uh, so hopefully we get out of here before it gets dark. I don't really like the dark. There's always these creepy things or there's all these sounds and noises. Especially and at 3 a.m. We are in the middle of nowhere. Check this place out. It's just like grass, rocks, leaves, some bushes. So I'm gonna go and try out all the other doors in the back. Okay. See if we can get out of here. Cool. Luckily you're so small you can fit back there. Ah. Okay. okay, so. Let's see. There, where, there's like where, no where's the door handle. There's no door handles anywhere. So here's like a sunroof. Uh huh. Uh, does it slide open it or anything? No. Chad, look at this over here. Up on the roof. You yeah. See this little thing. Huh? Like a secret compartment or something. Weird. Huh? All... Is there anything in there? Let's see. No, I no. can't feel anything. I wonder if there's a lot of like compartments around here that maybe has like a secret key that we can actually get out of here. Yeah, um, maybe in the back. You want to check way in the back? How do I get back here? Can you crawl over that? It's a pretty tight fit. This is really useful being like a tiny ninja. I'm glad I'm caught in here with you too because there's no way I would fit over that, I don't think. <laughs> you can do it, V. You can do it! <laughs> wow, you fit. I can't believe it. Are you alive? Pop your head up. There you are. <laughs> Here, V, I'm going to pass you the camera so you can show everybody what you're finding back there. Okay. Hey guys, I'm not sure if you can see this, but I'm looking for clues or anything. How did it escape? And there's nothing back here. See here, my feet. It's just nothing. Oh, V, I, I found a panel up here. Let me, let me, uh, let me see that. So I think I found something. Check this out. Check this out. Check this out, guys. I think I may have found a way out of here. It says driver. I think this is to open the door, so let me... Nope, it didn't open. Huh, okay. Oh, the screen just went blank. Okay, that was real nice. That's super helpful. Hey, V, I'm not having any luck up here. How about you? Yeah, I'm still looking for, like, handles or how to get out of here. So okay. I'm just gonna continue doing that. Hmm. Driving. Yeah, I'm looking through this here, V, and I am not seeing anything. Are you finding anything back there, V? Hey, V. V! What the heck? Hey, V. What the? V, do not be playing tricks on me because this is not funny at all. Okay, I'm gonna come back there. You better not be playing a trick on me. Ugh. Ugh. V. What the? Dude. V is not in here at all. Look look back here, guys. This is the trunk. V. What the heck? There's no way I can even fit back here. Let me see if I can put these seats down, maybe. Pull this down. Now I should be able to crawl back here. What's in this latch here? Oh, what? There's a mattress. There's a mattress in this little compartment here. There's another uh, hatch over here. I can pull that up, maybe. This is so weird. I don't know. No! You freaked me out! What are you doing? Why would you do that? I just wanted to see if there's any secret compartment back here. And oh I was just looking God. around to see if, there, if we can get out. This closed accidentally and I was like, oh my gosh, this is a perfect chance to scare Chad. Oh my gosh, you totally scared me. I'm very glad that you were just playing a trick V because I was really worried. Here, let me see how you fit in there. Like this. And then, then I grab this handle and go like this. See you later! <laughs> oh, you're not scared? No. Okay, come on out. No more hide and seek. Yeah. 
We're not playing hide and seek at 3 a.m. here. Yeah, we're not. Here, I'll show you where I found that mattress. There's a mattress in here? Yeah, like an air mattress. I was hoping to like find some treasure or something down here. Yeah. You know, if like, if we found another safe or just something really cool, like that lead us to another awesome treasure, maybe we can find another $100,000 treasure <laughs> That'd be sweet. I was really excited when we found this Tesla because I was like, wow, we got a free Tesla. But now it's pretty clear that someone's playing a trick on us. All right, so right here is another little latch. And uh, if I pull it up just like this, get it out of here. Let's check this out. Whoa. It's like an air mattress right here. Whoa. Oh, and this is like an air pump or something. It's Adapter. kind of like a treasure hunt right now. Yeah, but uh, I'm not really liking this treasure because does this mean we have to blow this up and sleep in here? I really- I don't wanna spend the night here. No, I wanna leave like right now and go home. And it's really hot in Palm Springs. The windows are up. I'm sweating right now. It's so hot. Yeah. Let's not even blow this up because I think we're gonna be able to get out of here. Yeah, so I, I think we should. Especially at 3 a.m. Cause yeah. like I watch a ton of other YouTubers videos and yeah. there's really crazy scary stuff that happens at 3 a.m. The sun's kind of setting. Yeah, it's getting pretty dark out. I think within an hour here, it'll be like pitch black probably. Why don't we try making a phone call? Luckily there's so many other YouTubers in Palm Springs here. Who do, who do you think we should call? Oh, um, gosh, it's so hard to trust anyone right now. Guys, leave a comment down below who you think we can trust to call. Should we call like Lizzie Cher? I don't think she would do this. Maybe Carter or Steven, Jake and Josh. Let us know guys who you think we should call down below. Uh, Maybe you should call Papa Jake. Papa Jake? I'm a little suspicious of him because I feel like he did something to the sharers. He did? What did he do? Um, He put the pond monster in their pond. He did? Yeah, he's the one who did it. And then they trapped him in a box fort, but it was all a misunderstanding, I guess. And there's actually like, they believe there's a third party or some other person sabotaging YouTubers. Oh. So I don't know if it's that third party or if it's actually Papa Jake, or maybe it's both Papa Jake and the sharers are playing a trick on us. I think I'm gonna call, I know, I'm gonna call Matthias. He's always been there for me. He, he never lets me down. Yeah, and we've been friends with him the longest. How come my phone's not ringing? Okay, I guess I have no signal at all. It says no service. That's great, Palm Springs, real good. No phone service out here in Palm Springs. That's real nice, guys. Um, it does say I have LTE though, so that's weird. So I can't make phone calls, but I can check on data. So maybe I can send a message. I know Matthias found a key recently, so maybe the key Matthias found is how we get out of here, or maybe it leads to some other clue, I'm not sure. Okay, so I just sent Matthias an email. I Hopefully he reads it soon. I don't know how often he checks his emails. Oh, I do have the Tesla key. Maybe the key can do something? So I'm gonna try this Tesla key here, guys, and see if it does anything. So I'm gonna press the button. Anything no happening? Nothing. Yeah, the key's not doing, whoa, look at the screen right now. It just popped up. It says, do not Wolverine claw. You see that? That's the name of one of my videos. Really? That I did with Jake and Josh. Oh no. Where I took Wolverine claws and I sliced soda cans. Oh no, is that a hint? All right, let's, let's climb back up front here and see if we can get on the internet and see what's going on. It's so tight, V. Mm. I'm too big for this. <laughs> My feet don't fit. Ah. Oh, jeez, that's pretty tight for me too. <laughs> now, why would that come up on the screen, guys? Um, is that a clue or something? Leave a comment down below what you think this means, guys. Maybe it's a clue to get out of here. I'm not sure. Maybe are we supposed to use Wolverine claws to get out of here, like break the glass or something? Oh. Is there is there like a hidden pair of Wolverine claws in here? Huh. Did we ever check these like cupboards down here? Oh, I don't know how these work. Oh. oh what's in there? A cable. cable. Oh, so maybe we could plug our phone in at least. Maybe that'll do something. Yeah, it does fit. Oh, sweet. Okay, well at least we can charge our phones. Yeah. Maybe that'll allow us to go on the internet. Is there anything? What, el what else? Oh, oh, that opens. What's in there? Oh. Mm. Are these? Are these are weapons? These? What? Oh, let's see. Okay, huh. Maybe it's like a puzzle piece or something? I don't know. Uh, well, now that my phone's plugged in, let's see if we can get onto YouTube. Let me go to that video. All right, so here it is, guys. You can see Do Not Wolverine Claw. It's my video. It's got 257,000 views. So it's still on here. Do Not Wolverine Claw. I see the video right here. So is there a clue in the video? Let me click into it here. Yeah, this was a great video. I remember this one. Where Josh was like juggling an axe. Well, maybe 
Maybe we need that axe to get out of here. Yeah. So I threw a banana at him, and then he chopped it in slow mo. It's pretty cool. Oh yeah. <gasps> Whoa! What? This video's been removed. By who? What the heck? Oh this... no! What the heck? Who's doing this? Is this better be a joke? That's one of my favorite videos we've done in a long time. Like I think we broke the world record in that video. We did, yeah. There's a world record that we broke for most apple slices. I really hope that's a trick because I really hope they did not delete that video. Guys, if you're watching this after this video, go look for that video. Do not Wolverine Claw. See if you can find it on my channel. Hopefully it's still there. Hopefully that was just like a trick and it's not actually deleted. I'm uh, actually getting like really worried right now. We're stuck in here. Someone hacked into your account. We can't call anyone. We don't have anything to like survive in here. I'm kind of, I'm kind of freaked out. I mean, who Who's doing this? Are, are they gonna like keep deleting videos off of my channel? Like that's serious. Deleting someone's video is like really serious because we spent a whole week making that, you know? What, what is that? Do you see that V? No. You hear that? What is that? I got my hand on, I can feel it. I got it, here it comes. It's, it's a bottle. An empty water bottle. It's pretty useless. Sorry to get I your mean, hopes up. If it was like full, then I can see a use of it because mm -hmm. we're gonna get pretty thirsty. Yeah. I mean, I'm kind of thirsty right now myself. Me too. I also have to go to the bathroom, so I better not drink anything. Uh, oh, you got yeah. a flashlight on your phone. Yeah, it's That's... getting it's getting too scary, so I need some light. I I, I yeah. don't like darkness, so I'm just I'm gonna try and use this. Shine it back there. Okay, there's just the mattress box. There's nothing else back there, really. Maybe we should blow up the mattress, just in case we need it. <laughs> I'm not saying we should give up, but just in case like we don't get an email back or the phone doesn't start working, it might be good just to have it, you know? What do you think? I don't want to be here anymore. That's what I'm thinking. I'm sure we'll, we'll figure out how to get out of here. Uh, but since there's nothing we can really do right now, let's just blow up the air mattress. Okay. All right, I'm gonna crawl back there. Oh man, can't believe I can't believe this. V. Can't believe we're stuck in a car. It's ridiculous. Ow! I barely fit back here. Ooh, this smells really rubbery. Well, whoever trapped us in here, at least they were nice enough to leave us an air mattress. So that, that makes me think that maybe it is someone playing a trick. Cause like, if someone was mad at us or someone didn't like us, why would they leave us an air mattress, yeah. right? But then again, why would someone who likes us- But why would they delete our YouTube channel? Yeah. Or our YouTube video, I mean. Well, I still think that might be like, maybe it's a joke. Like maybe they didn't actually delete it and then just, they made it look like. So once we get out of here, I'm gonna go do a search on my YouTube channel and see if it's still there. Let's blow this baby up here. Guys, I've been trying to blow it up for about 15 minutes here and it gets a little bit of air in it, but it's got a leak. I found a leak back here. Yeah, so whoever th I thought was being nice to us and giving us an air mattress, apparently they were not being nice to us and they gave us an air mattress with holes in it, so. Whoa! Did you see that? Dude, I just saw something and you saw it too, right? Guys, leave a comment down below if you see something. It's really, really dark, so we can't see very well, but maybe the camera's lighting's a little bit better and you guys can see something. Man, I, I swear I saw something, but then when we looked out there again, I didn't see anything. I'm so scared right now. I, um, think, I think it was just like an animal or something, so I don't think we need to be like freaked out. What time is it? Getting super late. It's 3 07 a.m. Holy crap. So we oh, so we saw something like right at 3 a.m. then because See, everybody sees all these creepy stuff at 3 a.m. Yeah, they why? tell us not to do stuff at 3 a.m. and yeah. people always tell us not to do it. What? And we didn't want to do it. I never want to do it. We're just, we're just kind of forced into it and I, I don't want to be here anymore. And like, is it just getting colder to you? It's getting really, I mean, it does get really cold in the desert at night. Sometimes it gets down to like 
40 or 30 degrees Fahrenheit, which I think is about zero Celsius. It gets really cold. I'm still like looking out the windows because I'm pretty sure I saw something. I kind of thought it was an animal, but now that I know it's 3 a.m., that makes me question if it was an animal or I, if it was something else. I am trying to avoid being near the window as much as possible. Maybe, I like, I don't want to be here and I don't want to look anywhere else. Maybe we should go in the back then if you don't want to be by the window. It might be safer back there. I guess. Well, especially, it seems like we might be having to spend the night here because no one's calling us back, our phones aren't working, uh, we're trapped in here, so we m might as well just go back there and I, I would say try to rest, but I feel like I'm not going to sleep at all because I'm way too freaked out right now. Um, I'm not sleeping. I don't know what you're doing, but I'm not sleeping tonight. I'm going to keep like an eye out. I should have bought some sage with me. I didn't know that sage. was happening. Sage? What's sage do? It wards off spirits and like mm. bad voodoo anything i don't yeah i don't think we have any sage but i think we might have some oregano that might work all right so v um you want to go back there then and it might be a little safer back there i'll crawl back here too here v hold the camera all right okay so now now what should we do um stay up completely alert i'm just like freaking out looking mm -hmm. you should keep an eye out in the front i'm gonna okay. keep an eye out okay. in the back here nothing can attack us if we get attacked we gotta be prepared chad oh yeah i'm, Alert. I'm ready i'm ready i know you are yeah i'm i'm just prepared to scream okay guys v and i fell asleep a little bit and uh i think it's probably like five in the morning or four in the morning what that's me what are you doing um i was sleeping and i got hungry I'm eating, I'm what eating, are you eating? I'm eating some Pocky. Oh, okay. You want some? Mm, no thanks. I am kind of thirsty now though. Now that I've been eating Pocky. I thought I saw a water bottle here earlier. Yeah? Oh, I I here it. it is. Wait, 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 don't drink that. Don't drink that. Why not? That's not, you don't want to drink that. Just okay. don't, just trust me. But yeah, you don't, you don't want that. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, trust me. You don't want that. I guess we'll just lay here until, sun, I think the sun will come up in like an hour or two. Yeah, so. we've been here forever. I'm, I'm really hungry. Good thing I have some, I always pack some snacks with me. Yeah, well, I think, look, why don't we just rest here? And I think the sun will be up in a couple hours. And then we'll, maybe once the sun's up, the car will start or something. I don't know. I'm going to turn this flashlight off to try to save some battery. And uh, we'll just keep an eye out out of the windows here. And while I stress eat. While you stress eat. Okay guys, it's the next morning and we put the seats back up. Have you tried getting out yet, V? Let's see if you can get out of here. Still nothing. Let me try mine. Nope. Okay, I don't want to be in here much longer. I don't know what we should do. <sighs> yeah. What was that outside last night? Uh, I feel like we saw something. I don't know. Do you see it? I don't even want to right think now? about it. See anything out there? No, I don't see anything. Huh. Whoa, 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 the car's moving. The steering wheel is moving by. Look at this, look at this. I'm not doing anything, guys. It's driving all by itself. What the heck? Guys, it's driving all by itself. I don't know what the heck. Look at this. You can see the wheel steering by itself right here. And I don't have my feet on the pedals at all. I don't know where it's taking us, guys. I'm freaking out because we've been trapped in here for a while and it's just taking us to another location and I have no idea where it's going. I hope it's somewhere in sunny, like Disneyland. Give us the thumbs up, guys, to wish us good luck that it brings us to a good place. This is like a possessed Tesla or something because it's creeping me out. Stop. Stop. What the heck? <gasps> Whoa. Oh. It's turning by itself whoa this is so weird i don't have my feet on the gas pedals or anything <gasps> oh, gosh. Well, Chad, where are we what, what what's happening i think we've been here before i recognize this place have we yeah i think does, so, well, so something on the screen's popping up oh my god chad and v i have a little game for you to play and if you don't complete it i will delete your youtube channel in front of me are three caves. Soon, you will exit the vehicle and find these caves. Each cave has a different task you must complete, so choose wisely. If you choose the cave right in front of me here, you will have to smash an egg on top of your head. If you choose this tunnel over here, you will be required to delete one of your YouTube videos. And then finally, this tunnel here, you will have to eat a tarantula spider. 
Choose now which tunnel you want to go through. Is this for real? Is this really gonna happen? Whose hands are those? Like, is that someone we know? I yeah. Think, like someone's tricking us. Cause like this is just getting out of hand, you guys. I don't want to have to delete anything on right. my channel. And I don't want to eat a tarantula or break an egg on my head. I mean, these practical jokes are just not funny anymore. I mean, whoever it is, come up with it. We're sick of this. In case it is real, I guess we better choose one. I think we should keep an eye on the box with the egg. That's probably the one that we should probably do. So let's keep an eye on that one with okay. the egg. Okay. All right, you guys keep an eye on it too, because we need more eyes on this. Yeah, all right, let's watch it. Have you chosen your cave? Then I will now shuffle them. All right, guys, comment down below which box I should pick. Comment V1, V2, or V3. Who should go first? I think I would like to go first. I mean, I would like to go first, too, because the odds are better for whoever's going first. So, like, how right. do we decide, like, who's going to go first? Um, I think I'm going to go first. Can you get out? No. Well, how are we supposed to play this stupid game if, like, if you did... No! Oh! Crap! It just opened automatically. I guess that means you're going first. Do I have to wait in here now or what? Whoa! Saya, so, uh, that means I'm going second then, or? I guess we just better follow instructions to the T. I guess. Let's go outside and see where this takes us. Oh my gosh! Oh, yes, yeah. look! It's the tunnels, guys. That must be the one that he's talking about. Yeah, so let's see. That's tunnel one, that's tunnel two, and tunnel three. So which one did you think had the eggs in it, V? I thought it was tunnel three. I'm not quite sure, though, but that's... That's what I'm hoping. All right, so tunnel three then is that one. I hope you're right, V, because I know you don't want to eat a tarantula. <laughs> or delete a video on my YouTube channel. I just came back. All right, guys, I really hope we get the eggs because I don't want anything else in any of those tunnels. Are you going to come with me? Or? I think I'm going to stay out here because I need to decide which one I want to take. Do I want to try to eat a tarantula or do I want to delete a YouTube video? I'm going to think about that while you go in your <laughs> tunnel, so I can't decide. Okay, come on, guys. Let's go. Like, <laughs> Whoa, look at this gate here. It's like I'm caged in. I hope it doesn't fall down on me. Super, super steep. Oh my gosh. Everything's really rough. Oh my gosh, I thought I touched a tarantula or something. Ah! I'm not quite sure where it is or like what to look for. I'm looking for an egg, but I'm also trying to avoid a tarantula if I happen to be in a tarantula cave. There's all these like random writings here. What if the mysterious guy is like leaving some clues for us? Like revealing his true identity. Another gate? I mean, I don't know if I can fit through here. It's completely locked. These chains are here. Do I have to break in? <gasps> I think I found it! Is this the egg? Oh, is this the miracle egg? I'm so glad. Is that a tarantula? I've never been happy to see an egg before. All right, I guess I'm just gonna put this egg in my backpack and make my way out of here. It's kind of creepy in this tunnel anyway, so come on, let's get out of here. These bars are actually kind of handy now. <gasps> guess what I had to do, Chad? Um. I don't see any egg in your hair. No. So you had to delete a video? No, I had to eat a tarantula. Oh. Oh. Actually, I'm really glad because I didn't want to eat the tarantula. I'm glad, so I'm glad you did. Just kidding, I got the egg. Oh, oh. Man. <laughs> that means I need to either eat a tarantula or I need to delete a YouTube video. Yeah, yeah. I don't want to do either of those. Wait, wait, I gotta. No. Nope. I'll crack it on my own head. No, no. Nope. Do you gotta crack the egg on your head now or should I go through my tunnel first? I don't know. Maybe <laughs> you should go to your tunnel first. Yeah. All right. Which tunnel should I do? Guys, vote down below. I think I'm going to want to eat a tarantula. Chad, I'm going to wait out here for you because I don't want to <laughs> bump into a tarantula. But I think you should go in tunnel number one. Cause, number one. Because Chad, you're number one. Oh, thanks. <laughs> I was thinking number one as well. I feel like he probably would have put the spider in number one. Why? I don't know, because I think he thinks that I would choose number two. Why? I don't know. <laughs> Maybe he knows me really well. I think I'm gonna go with number one. Let's go, let's go check out number one here. I'm feeling like a tarantula's in here. That's what I want. I don't want to delete a video. Okay, it's got a cool little step here. I guess I just gotta jump up. 
You know, now that I'm up here, I'm having second thoughts. I feel like the delete YouTube videos in this one. So I don't want to go on here. I'm not getting the tarantula vibe in this one. So I think I'm going to come back down and I'm going to go in tunnel number two. If it's wrong, you guys are probably like, Chad, stop, no, no. Little, little crack down here I got to get through. Okay. Guys, I think I'm in the right place because I do see some cobwebs up there in the corner. So maybe there's a tarantula hanging out. I really I don't want to eat a tarantula, but I guess that's better than deleting a YouTube video, so. Huh, I'm not seeing any more cobwebs anymore. That has me a little bit concerned. Oh, I see a bunch of light up here. Is this like a way out or something? Okay, it's kind of a dead end here. Um, there's a wall. There's like a crack here, but I can't fit through it. So I'm looking for a spider. I don't see any cobwebs or anything. Um, what do you guys see if you look around? If you, uh, can you guys see up there higher? Oh wait, what the heck is this? Let's see if I can reach it. Ah, it's way up there. Ah. <laughs> you guys see this? It's a computer. Wait a second. I found a computer before. It made us do a challenge before. And this kind of looks like the same computer, actually. Well, I guess I'm gonna just keep this and bring it back. And uh, I don't see any tarantulas or any notes that say I need to delete a YouTube video. So I guess I'll just go back out, meet up with V, have her crack the egg over her head, and then maybe I'll find a tarantula on the way out. I don't know. All right, guys, leave a comment down below what you think is... <laughs> Who's gonna be on this laptop right here? I think it's gonna be a prize. It's a secret prize. I think it's my lucky day. I, I think I don't have to eat a tarantula or delete a YouTube video. Let me know down below. Hey, V, guess what? What? There was no tarantula in there, but someone left their laptop in there. Why are you so happy? Because <laughs> I got a free laptop. <laughs> no, it probably means that you have to delete your video. Oh shoot, I didn't even think of that. Well, I guess let's see what's in here. Okay. Oh, you can you see that okay, V? <laughs> so hold it, <laughs> so hold it, hold it, hold it down bit, here for you. It says, congratulations, you do not have to break an egg on your head or eat a tarantula, but you do have to- Delete a video? Man. What? Oh, man. Shoot. Gosh, Chad, I'm in all those videos with you. So which one are they gonna man, make us delete? I don't wanna delete any. You know what? I think I'm just gonna not delete it. I mean, what's the big deal? What's he gonna do? N no, you have to delete it. Because otherwise he's going to delete your whole entire channel. I mean, I'd rather lose just one video rather than the whole entire channel. Did he say he was going to delete the whole channel? Yeah. I mean, don't you think we should just delete one video rather than the whole entire channel? What if he's like bluffing? Maybe he doesn't mean it. He's checking to see if we'll like obey him. Maybe he doesn't even have the power to delete our channel. Maybe he's like tricking us. I don't know if you should take that risk or not because like he's doing all these weird mysterious things like how did he get this laptop here? How did yeah. he get the Tesla to drive? How do we get trapped? I wouldn't take that risk. He actually already did delete one of my videos, remember that. So he must have my password or something. Let's just take care of this. I want to crack an egg on my head because I don't want to delete a video or my whole entire channel. I got to sit down and do this, so let's let's walk over here. Well, I guess I'm going to delete my YouTube video now. It says I'm supposed to delete my Fergie parody that I did, uh, oh, it's about two years ago almost. 111,000 views and I have to delete this video. Oh, man. Doesn't that suck? All right, let's see. I'm, I don't even think I've ever deleted a video before. So I'm gonna go here, click this down arrow, and then there's a delete button. You can't undo this. Oh man, this is nerve wracking. Ready for me to delete it, B? Uh, not really, but I guess it's way better than getting your whole entire channel deleted or getting hacked. True, very true. I'm just gonna do it. Three, two, one. I don't wanna do it. <laughs> This sucks. 111,000 views gone for good. 1,300 comments, 1,300 thumbs up. Deleted. There it goes. Oh, uh, it just disappeared off the screen. This sucks. If you look for that Fergie parody by Chad Clay, it's now missing forever. But anyway, V, it's time for you to crack an egg on your head. Uh... So let's switch places here. I'll hold the camera. Ready to break an egg? <laughs> Ready to break a leg. That was kind of bad. Okay, yeah, let's see. Right here it is. Three, two, one, go! <laughs> Ah, I didn't even break it! I really don't want to do okay. this. Three, two, one, go! Ah, okay. Weak! <gasps> okay, it's still okay. okay. Three, two, one, snap! Oh. 
Julia. Ew. Oh, disgusting. Ew, that's oh so gosh. gross. Nasty. Oh, you look really great there. That's a great hairstyle. I like it, V. I I like it. Oh, Jesus, so gross, you guys. I need to go like clean myself up. We're heading back to the Tesla now. We don't even know if we're gonna be able to get into it. I actually uh, really don't want to get into it anymore. Yeah, we already got trapped in it for 24 hours. Um, uh, uh-oh. I'm noticing we got a parking ticket or something. Man, I ain't paying no parking ticket. This isn't my car. Oh, it's not a parking ticket. V, check it out. I have hidden $10,000 in this Tesla. What? Did you leave this here, V? No, I don't trust anything. I don't know, is it what, $10,000 Monopoly money or what? Yeah, exactly, like this is a trick or something. Why would someone leave $10,000 in this car? And it, check engine, why? Is the engine gonna like... Explode? <laughs> I hope not. Oh I ain't God. getting in there. Whoa! You see that? The engine hood just popped open here. I mean, how close is this guy? Every time we say something, something happens. Like he's really close yeah. by. There's like someone watching us or something. Oh man. What is in here? I'm kind of scared. What? Whoa, there's like balls. It's like a it's like a playground. What are we at, McDonald's or something? In the playpen? <laughs> well, I guess we'll try to find the $10,000 in here, V. Uh, guys, give us a thumbs up on this video right now to wish us good luck. Hopefully we find $10,000 and hopefully it's not a trick. Okay, I'm not putting my fingers on it. I'm just gonna look for the balls or the $10,000 or whatever it is like like this. Cause I, I, <laughs> I don't want anything crazy like tarantulas because we never found that tarantula. That's true. So it could be in here. So I'm just protecting oh, myself. I hope not. Ow, oh, tarantula! Oh, oh, oh my gosh! <laughs> oh my gosh! I was Why just, did you do I that? was just kidding oh me. Oh my god! I was pretending a tarantula bit me. Oh <laughs> my god! I thought. Gotcha! High five! Okay, I won't scare you anymore, V. Okay, I promise. Okay. Huh? I'm just seeing balls in here. <gasps> What's this? Oh, weird. Yeah, but guys, these balls have little letters on them. Is this an I? Or is it a T? Oh no, it's or an I. It an or is it a smiley face like this, and it's missing his eyes? Every time we find one with letters, we'll set it over here and maybe that, maybe that's a clue or something. Let's see what else is in here. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa! What is this? The ghost meter. Oh whoa, my god. Oh, that is crazy. Am I right? Is this car haunted? It seems like it. Whoa, and the meter's kind of moving already. Look at this. Oh my god, do you think that thing that we saw at 3 a.m. last night? Was a ghost, Chad? I mean, I hope it was a deer or an animal or like a elephant or something, but hopefully not a ghost. Well, that's weird that the meter's already moving, even though there's like no battery in here. That's kind of creepy. Look at that. The, the meter's like totally moving. Oh my moving. god. So this thing's haunted too? Does it yeah. come with a pre-ghost loaded? A pre-ghost loaded. <laughs> loaded? There's a ghost in here. Oh my god. <laughs> You're crazy, V. Well, since it seems to be working without the batteries, why don't we test this car out and see if it's haunted? Okay, so it's not haunted in the front of the car here. Uh, let's keep going around here. Not, oh, the meter kind of moved a little bit right here. Did you guys see that? It moved a little bit, but now it's green again, so uh, no ghost over here. Okay, V, uh, I don't think there's a ghost in the car because the meter's not moving, so I think we're safe. All right, I think, it's, I think it's just like another YouTuber or somebody playing a trick on us, or maybe setting up a surprise for us and giving us $10,000. That's what I really hope. Maybe, do you think this is worth $10,000? Like maybe huh. it's like, like a very old and unique scale or something, meter. Yeah, maybe yeah. look it up online and see if it's worth anything, V. The ghost the, meter. The ghost meter. Oh, it's like 20 bucks, you guys. So it's not 10,000 at all. Well, I, I really, really hope we get like $10,000 worth of stuff, guys, because we've been through so much. We got locked in the Tesla for 24 hours. I had to delete one of my YouTube videos. <laughs> I need $10,000 just to replace that YouTube video because I'm so sad about it. I'm not sad, I'm mad. I'm sad, I'm mad, I'm Chad, but I'm also glad, as you can see. <laughs> and you're pretty rad. I'm pretty rad, I'm not bad. And now we're gonna find $10,000. Let's keep digging in here. You still scared of the spider? I am. I'm, you guys, no fingers are touching anything in this trunk. I keep finding more balls with letters, so I'm gonna put these over here. Here's an H, guys. Oh my god. Whoa! What look is at this? That. What I, is? I recognize these. We've got spy gear before, guys. Okay, so this is a motion alarm. Huh. Are we setting a trap for someone? Maybe we're supposed to set a motion alarm on the car, so if anyone comes towards it while we're finding the ten thousand dollars, we get a, an alert or something. Huh. Should we try it? All right, let's try it. So this is a motion sensor, guys. The way this works is you put it somewhere. When someone walks by it, it makes a loud noise. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn it on here. All right, we'll put it right there on top of the car. Let, let's test it out with me first, see if it goes off. Okay, let's see if it goes off. Okay. Nope, no. too, too short. <laughs> it is, 
natural spy, you know? Okay. There's a nothing can sense me. All right, so you're too short, so you walk right under it. Maybe we should put it down lower. Let's put it down right there. If anyone tries to come around the corner and get us while we're investigating the car, it's gonna go off. Now let's test it, go ahead. Whoa, it's Oh loud. my gosh, it was so loud! Good! There we Jeez. go. Okay, so we know it works. I think we should put it in a better place, Chad. Okay. Because I feel like this right here, anybody can see it. Yeah. I think we'll just put it like underneath the tires. Oh, nice. That's a great right idea. There. Yeah, nobody will see that. Yeah, so it's totally hidden. No one will suspect this. So we should probably look up how much this thing is worth. Maybe this is worth something to get us towards that $10,000 goal. Oh, okay. What is this thing called? This is the Spy X Motion Alarm. Protect your stuff. I'm gonna protect my Tesla. I'm just gonna say that this is my Tesla now. I think I get to keep it after all of this. Oh, okay, oh, so, okay. okay. Oh, it's only $9. <laughs> hey, I mean, that's something. What's our total now, like uh, $29? $29. We're slowly getting to that $10,000 goal, guys. Yeah. We can do it, we can do it. Let's, let's see what else is in here. Oh, I found another letter, guys. I found it. This one's green and it's an I. Whoa, I reckon it looks like a football helmet. Dude, do we could just get season tickets to the New England Patriots? That's worth a lot of money. V, you love football. What? Go sports. <laughs> <laughs> That's how much I love sports, you guys. Guys, if you love sports like V, leave a comment down below. What is your favorite sports team? Is it the New England Patriots? Is it the Minnesota Twins? Or the, you mean the Minnesota Vikings? It's because it's football? Oh yeah, this is football. <laughs> Hey, I said sports team, I didn't say football team. Okay. I know I know the twins are not football. Come on. Okay. Come on. I don't think it's season tickets. I think it's a remote control helicopter. Look at that. What? That's cool. It's a football helmet helicopter. Check that out. Oh. So cute. maybe this is a spy gadget in its own. Like you fly up in the air and you can film people down below oh. and spy on people. Is this guy hiding in a tree or something? Maybe there's a camera on here or something. Yeah, we can fly up into a tree and see if there's any hidden cameras around here, if there's a guy hiding in a tree or something. Yeah. Why, why don't we try that? There's a bunch of trees here, guys. We're gonna fly this thing up and investigate, see if there's any hidden cameras up there or any people hiding. Are you ready, V? All right, yeah, let's try this. Oh. Oh. oh shoot! Oh. It's going crazy! It's going crazy! Guys, come check this out. It fell down into the mud and made a big dent in the mud here. <laughs> you kind of freaked out there, V, huh? I did. I didn't think it was gonna be that fast. Alright, let's try it again. Are you ready? Yes. Whoa! Oh. What the heck? How am I supposed to control this thing? All right. Okay, let me let me try this. You try. Let me try this. It's all muddy. Look at all this mud down here. Ew. <laughs> Up. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> it's a tree branch. It hit a tree branch. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, you can turn it off. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Whoa. You got this, V. Hey, wait a second. The the front of the helmet fell off somewhere, guys. It's no. missing. He got tackled really hard. Oh! Oh, oh, oh. oh, oh! Okay, guys, we made it fly over here behind this fence. Uh, it looks like we are locked out of this fence here, guys. Maybe that's a clue. Maybe it's leading us somewhere over here. It's way back there. I don't know. If we should go back here, Chad. Yeah. I think this, this is fenced off for a reason. I think. I think I think we should probably check in the Tesla to see if there's more clues to see if it says we should go back there or not. So Okay. Alright, so how much was this thing worth if we look it up? Remote control helmet flyer. Twenty dollars only. Okay. Wow. If, if we keep finding twenty dollar items, we just have to find like what? 500 of them and we'll get $10,000. We're looking for more clues to see if we're supposed to go back there behind the fence. I have a feeling that these balls with letters are gonna tell us something about that. So let's find all of them. And you guys can help us out by telling us if these letters spell something or not. I can't tell if this is a five or an S. It almost spelled something really bad there. She, she see. She see. I hope it's in English and not in like Japanese or something. Yeah. It sounded like Japanese for a little bit there. It did. Q. Whoa. A Q? That's weird. Here's um here's a broom. I mean a Y. You know, why don't we put these down in the grass? Okay. Good idea, Chad. V, what I'm thinking is I'm noticing there's green and yellow. So maybe the green should go together. 
okay. and then the yellow should go together. Okay, ninjas, help us figure this out. We've got three green letters here. Can these be rearranged to spell a word? We need to figure that out. Leave a comment down below if you can figure that out. Checked out the yellow here, so I think the yellow is gonna be a different word. We have an S, a Q, a C, or maybe that's a U, I don't know. That could be either a C or a U. I, H, S, and a Y. Can these be rearranged to spell out a word? I think that is our next clue that we have to figure out, guys. All right, back into the trunk, looking for more treasure. We gotta get that $10,000. We're not even close yet. Oh. Oh, well, another spy thing. Ooh, a spy gadget, nice. We always need more of those, Chad. Yeah, I know. So it's a Spy X Recon watch. Well, why don't we try the watch on? You want to wear the watch, V? Sure. It's for ages six and up, so you just made it, V. Look at that. Whoa. Look at this. It goes, it opens like Whoa, that. Whoa, nice. Oh, that is wow. cool. There's got to be like more buttons around here. Yeah. Oh, there's like two buttons over on the side here. Try that one. Okay. Try the other one. Oh, whoa, whoa, a noise. the lights just flashed. I heard a noise. Whoa, look at the trunk's opening. Whoa. Whoa. whoa, okay. What's this? This is weird. Okay. Create a, a square. square by moving one stick to reveal your treasure. Okay, guys, check this out. We're going to need your help. We need to create a square by moving one stick. V, what do you think? How can we move one of these sticks and create a square? No, it's kind of difficult because like I, I need to move like two. Yeah, I don't know. This is kind of a tough one. I don't know. I feel like it's impossible because yeah, if you look at it, I could create a square if I put a stick here and a stick here. That would create a square. But how can you move just one? All right, guys, leave a comment down below. Help us out. Type in stick one, stick two, stick three, or stick four to let us know which stick we should move to create a square. So hopefully you guys are leaving comments down below right now to help us out because we don't want to choose the wrong stick. If we move number four here, I don't think a square. Oh my gosh, Chad, I, I think I, I figure it out. Yeah? I think I figure it out. Okay, let's see. It's kind of tricky. I, I think you move number two here. Okay. Just like this. Oh, and, and then a square. a square. Look at that. It Whoa! Whoa! Did you hear that sound? I heard something up there inside. It was coming from inside the car here. I hope it, hope it wasn't that ghost that we saw before. I don't see anything in there. Is the meter moving? No. Oh, check this out. Check this out. I see there's like like something in the, the glove compartment opened or something. You see that? And there's like a, there's like a note or something right there. That must have been the noise, guys, that we heard. Maybe the glove compartment opened up. All right, okay, let's get in. All right. Huh, the door is not opening. <sighs> of course it's not. I guess we got to crawl through. Luckily, you're small, V. Obviously, I got this. I do this all the time. Yeah. You're the little mini spy who can crawl into small things, V. Yeah. I guess I'll crawl up there with you, V. All right, you guys ready? Let's do this. Oh, man, okay. All right, so what do we got, V? Okay, hold on. I gotta, just to make sure, you guys. Uh, you don't I'm touch not touching it. anything. <laughs> oh, I see a note there. What's that note say? Oh, it says, congrats. Here's your treasure. What's my treasure? What is it? What is that? Because yeah, we're nowhere near 10,000. And that's not worth ten thousand dollars. Oh, what? was Look this the... was this the tar tarantula that they're talking about in the cave? Huh, it looks like a spider. It does look like a spider. Huh, or maybe it's an octopus, like a rainbow octopus here. Why is this a treasure? It says, "Here's your treasure." Someone playing a joke on us. Yeah, obviously someone's playing a joke on yeah, us. Yeah, like doing all this crazy thing. Like this is worth ten thousand dollars. Yeah, right. We're nowhere near ten thousand dollars. Why don't we just look it up and see how much this is worth? Oh, he has a name. Okay. It says Claude. Claude. Okay. Oh, the I remember these Beanie Babies thingies oh, yeah. from the nineties. I You're mean, right. I, I was like one, but yeah. you know. Yeah, the Beanie Babies collection. Okay, so maybe it's like a collectible item because yeah, Beanie Babies. I do remember a lot of people collected these a long time ago. I can't find any like website about it, but I did find one that's for sale, the, uh -huh. the exact one. And look, in the description it says, Thai tag includes star. Let me see. Okay, okay so there's a star. Oh. Whoa, ours has a star too. So this must be the same one. Oh my gosh. And it says Claude on it. Chad, you will not believe how much this costs. Let me guess. $500. No. More? Way higher. $1,000 for no. this? No. Higher than a thousand? Yes! 
is over ten thousand dollars. What? I mean, let's see, let's see. It. Right here. Oh my gosh, twenty-five thousand dollars for a beanie baby? Look at that. It's the same one. It's the exact what? same one. I'm like, Whoa, it's... dude, we just got a twenty-five thousand dollar beanie baby. That is insane. Yeah, wrap that I'm gonna up. Wrap this up. Who would put that in here? Oh, it does say something else on the other side here. Whoever makes the best Fortnite blank blank keeps the Tesla. And you gotta put letters in here. We we found a bunch of um, those pit balls earlier. Those balls with letters, yeah. Yeah, let's, let's, let's go outside go, and look. Uh, all right. Oh, dude, I think this is totally it because we got three green ones. So dash, 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 three green. And then we had seven dashes here. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So this has got to be it. We've got to figure out what this says. It's like a game of hangman, V. Yeah. So the first one, what could this be? Uh, ID? ID? Yid? Yid? Yid. Oh! Oh, oh! It's, uh, it's DIY, Chad. Oh, DIY. Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So, like, do it yourself. Yeah. And the next one is, like, this C is throwing me off here. Maybe. Like it's it's really weird. Well, usually when you have a Q, you have a U after it. Sometimes W, like my last name, Q W. But in in real English, there's never a W after a Q. But you know, it's cool. Real English. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait, you got it. Good, squishy. Squishy. So wait, whoever makes the best Fortnite DIY squishy keeps the Tesla. <gasps> oh, okay, so they're challenging us to a little challenge here. Yeah. All right, let's do that. So what Fortnite object should we build? We should build something that we can like break open at the end. Maybe one of those loot llamas. Yeah! We have to do it against each other like a challenge, and whoever built the better squishy gets to keep the Tesla. Tesla! Give us a thumbs up, guys, to wish us good luck. We hope that this person is not tricking us. We might need your good luck to win that Tesla. I'm gonna win this, I'm gonna, I wanna win that Tesla. I Go highly doubt it, I have a lot more experience doing DIY stuff. I actually watched my friend Karina Garcia's squishy video. That's right, but uh, I know Fortnite very well. I saw your dancing video. <laughs> I don't know how well you know Fortnite. <laughs> All right, let's do this, guys. Vote below right now who you think is gonna win the Tesla at the very end. Vote below the Tesla if you think I'm gonna win or Chad Tesla if you think he's gonna win. The key ingredient to making a squishy is this big, foam right here. And I'm actually gonna make mine a little thicker and bigger, so I'm gonna add um, another layer of foam on top of this. So I'm gonna start gluing. I don't know what your plan is, Chad. I'll just watch you for first and see, see what I wanna do. Well, you know what I'm gonna do? Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Lay it down. I'm not copying V at all. I came up with this idea on my own. It's nice, Chad. <laughs> you look comfortable. Your yeah! <sighs> this isn't very soft or squishy. Mine's like memory foam, like yeah. high quality foam. Chad's like the, you know, the 99 cents discount foam. <laughs> okay guys, the next process is to draw the llama onto this foam. I'm not a great drawer, are you Chad? I'm amazing. Ugh, of course. My foam's coming apart. Chad's already failing. Hey. What? 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 I'm not trash talking. Oh no, his horn's gonna be a little short. <laughs> it's, not a horn? it's a llama ear, V. It's oh, not it's a not. Horn. It's not a unicorn llama. <laughs> Llamas don't have horns, V. <laughs> oh crap! You are a better drawer <laughs> than me. <laughs> oh my gosh! I'm trying my best because I really want that Tesla, V. I'm gonna beat you. I'm determined to have the better. Fortnite squishy. I'm gonna try my best too, but I don't, I don't know. Sorry guys, if you voted for me. <laughs> Look at mine! Wow, yours is like a big square! My llama is done being drawn, ready to cut. Stay away from me. I know you've got a lot of experience with weapons, but not with cooking and cutting devices. <laughs> you have no experience with cooking. You better watch it. I'm kind of scared. Ooh, it's cutting like butter. I only got through one layer. This is a lot thicker and harder to cut through than Chad's. Oh, sure, excuses. Can you help me, Chad? OV, check this out. Beautiful llama, woo! Oh my gosh, <laughs> he is beautiful. Hey. I got two llamas, <gasps> woo! Wait, can I have 
Can I just no, have this one? <laughs> Two thousand years later. I'm still on the butt, you guys. He's in very rough condition. There's no smooth edges. Like, look at the struggle right here. He's gonna have like jet edge. Edged. He has a verbal problem and a cutting problem. And a husband problem. Oh, burn! I sure am glad you're not my dentist. I'm just cutting out his tongue so he doesn't talk anymore because I like a partner that's quiet. Wow! <laughs> you know what? You, he can't get his tongue out. Just, oh, you ripped I'm it out! I'm just gonna rip it out! <laughs> it looks so bad. Chad! Anybody who uh, voted for me so far, take a look at what you voted for. No! Turn this way! It's slightly better this way. Help me! Help me! <laughs> Let's move on to the painting. For the paint, we are mixing white paint with glue. Equal parts of each into these bowls here. We're gonna make purple, light blue, and dark blue. These making weird sounds. Same sounds that you make in the bathroom show. Hey, I don't do that. <laughs> here comes the paint. Oh, that's there we good. Go. <laughs> hey B, are you feeling blue? <laughs> Not when you're around. Aw, oh, thanks. I can be nice to chat too. We mixed all our colors and now we're gonna start painting and make sure to paint down, paint down below. Paint, paint down below right now. Make sure to comment down below who you think will be a better painter. Comment V Paint or Chat Paint or Microsoft Paint if you think, ah. neither. We just painted this and it didn't work too well so we're gonna add some shaving cream to the paint to thicken it up. Oh yeah, look at the spread. Much better. That's beautiful. Ooh. Yeah, so satisfying. It's like a marshmallow peep. All right, I'm using this spongy paint brush here and I'm gonna texturize it. All I'm doing is going like this to create some texture and like really make it pop. Wait a second. How did you do that, V? How'd you do that texturizing? It's a secret. Ooh, that looks like crap. Good, because I have big plans with the Tesla when I win it. Oh! You're not gonna win it, V. It's gonna be my Tesla. So this is felt paper that we have. I'm just cutting it in half to fit the size of my llama. Just cut out the white of my eyes, and I'm gonna cut out the little eyeball. There's the eyeball. That's gonna be a very large eye on a tiny little llama head. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna look super cute, because he has large eyes. Now I'm gonna add his little face strap, harness thing? I don't know what it's called. Hey, is yours in a fashion show or what? It's got a choker there. <laughs> Mine's just like a cute one, you know? Yeah, look at my llama, V. Gonna win that Tesla. I, I think Chad's done with his llama, but my winning factor is I'm gonna attach a tail to it. That's just the extra special V touch that you should vote for. Okay guys, it's the next day. We had to wait 24 hours for our llamas to dry and we are ready to present them and have you guys vote to see which one is the better llama. Whoever has the better llama wins the Tesla. So you guys need to vote to decide who has the better loot llama. But let me tell you, your correct vote is for me. Is it? Yes, Why? it is. Why should they vote for you? Please? All right, let me. Wow, that's beautiful. I think my llama looks almost identical to the original llama. It has a very long neck and this boxy body right here. And I follow the um, pattern on it exactly to the T. So I want to point out how nicely drawn my arrow is, very symmetrical. And the added extra bonus right here, the tail. It's upside down because it's very excited that I'm going to be the winner. <laughs> and uh, my personal touch with my V harness, that's personalized for my llama. All right, let's see yours, Chad. Move that llama out of here. Let me show you the true winner, guys. You should vote for Chad's llama because look how handsome he is. He's got a little uh, circle there. It's the sun. He's he's happy as the sunshine, you know. And check out this beautiful paint job. You'll notice every color is a different pattern. Here we have circles in the light blue. Yeah, you what know, happened to this one? Where's we, the pattern on this one? This one is solid. I don't think the original llama yeah. has any solid. Instead of going original, I decided to go creativity. Because uh. here in the purple, we have diamond. Here's my beautiful loot case. I made it so on mine you can lift up and reveal the loot inside. You can, oh, mine can lift up. Hey, we are, just, we are just showing. Letting, you know, we're not showing your llama right now. We're showing my llama. Get back over here. He's tailless. No tail. Where's your tail? He doesn't need a tail. He's so good at balance because a tail helps you balance, right? But my guy is so good at balancing. He's like a ninja karate. Hey, yeah! Like he can just, he can backflip. No problem. 
No problem. He doesn't need a tail for balance. That's how good he is. You guys should vote for Lee Ma Lee Lama. Lee Vama? <laughs> Valama. That was what I was trying to say. Because look, look, he can accessorize. Look wow. how adorable. He can wear a hat. <laughs> look how, yeah. He's, can yours? No, I don't think so. You know what? That looks like a dunce hat. Like he was a bad boy in school. No, he's adorable, Chad. Oh, Come yeah? Look. Well, you should vote for Chad's llama because he doesn't wear a stupid hat. He wears a sweet backpack. He puts ninja weapons inside of his backpack. Vote Chad Llama below now. Beat that, B. Beat that. My llama can carry things in his mouth. Look at this bucket that he can carry. Well, guys, you should vote for my llama because he doesn't carry nothing in his mouth other than a lightsaber. He hits buckets with his lightsaber. <laughs> I hate buckets. But Mai can ride a scooter. Really? Yes. yes. Let's see it. All right, let's go. Oh, oh it's riding a scooter. Oh, wait, wait, wait a second, wait a second. Stop, Mr. Llama. You see, look, look what's going on over here. It's me. <laughs> no, he was he was totally riding it by himself. What? So you should totally vote for V Llama right now because my llama can ride a scooter. Yeah, well, my llama has a special trick up its sleeves as well. My llama has hands. Check it out, V. Oh my god! Oh my god! This is so creepy. Give me a hug. No. Give my llama a hug. Give Mr. Give llama a hug. No. <laughs> Mr. Llama feels sad now that V called him creepy. So go vote down below. And don't forget, a thumbs up. Mr. Lama says give th two thumbs up to this video. <laughs> All right, guys, you should vote for my llama because he has a lot of street cred. You know, he can dance. He can do the Fortnite dance, the wiggle. Wow, Adam, he's, he's such a good dancer. His tail fell out. Oh, well, my llama can dance as well. Check this out. It can do a backflip like that. Oh, yeah, woo! Wait, wait, Whoa, wait a what's that? Something, something fell out of my llama here. A note. Dude, there's a note in my llama. The winner's loot is in the llama. Where did this note come from, V? I don't know. Do you think somebody messed with our llamas while it was drying outside last night? Yeah, maybe the mystery guy came by who set this whole thing up and he put a note inside my llama. Like, what, what do you think he meant by the winner? Well, the member we're supposed to see who wins the Tesla by who builds the better llama. Because in the game Fortnite, you break open the llama and there's loot inside, so maybe we have to break ours open? Oh man, I don't want to break mine. Yeah. I really like mine. I really like mine too. Will you hold mine real quick? But I want to see if I've got some loot inside, so I've got my Fortnite stop sign axe. I'm not going to break mine. I'm just going to search around, just, you know, look inside him to see if there's any clue or any prizes. I think inside, I'm going to find a nice little prize. Give me a countdown, guys. Three, two, I found a Tesla key! It was in your llama? Yeah, it was in here. No! Look, you guys, it was deep inside my llama. So I pulled it out, and it was a Tesla key! I wanted to win the Tesla, <laughs> but I'm happy you won. You deserve it, V. You can ride in the passenger seat. Oh, yeah, sweet shotgun. I can't wait to try this out. Do you want to try it out, Chad? I hope it works. Let's go try it out. All right, let's go. Oh my god. All right. Okay. Is it gonna work? Is it gonna, Is it gonna work? work? Here's All right. the, the moment of truth right here. Oh my gosh, uh, the moment of truth, you guys! Three, two, one, unlock! 